Hello everyone, I'm John, this is Sean, All right. and this is Everyday Food Reviews. Today, we're taking another look at Too Good To Go. Yeah, so last time uh, we looked at Too Good To Go, we uh, did a full review and demonstration of the app yep. itself. Um, if you don't know uh, much about it, you don't know how to use it, you don't know what it is, you can watch our last video, we should be able to put a link yeah, here. our first video on Too Good um, To Go. Yeah, to, to that video, so you can go check that out if you want to find out how to use the app. Um, yeah, we, we looked at a, a Chinese restaurant in Liverpool. Yep. Um, now we're going somewhere else. There's... Yeah, now we we did say in that video that, well, we saw Ben Brazil. Yeah. We're big steak lovers, um, mm. Redizio uh, restaurant lovers. We've been to a couple ourselves. Uh, so when we, I've been to Ben Brazil myself. Yeah. Have, have you? Yes. Yeah. So we've in, both been. In Liverpool. Yeah, we've got. Now, Liverpool Ben Brazil is on the app. But it was, there's nothing ever available. No, not that a bit strange. Seen. However, there's two restaurants in Manchester, and they usually they, they do have some left, and we we bought them last night. Yep. Um, so we're gonna go over to Ben Brazil in the northern quarter. Yep. Uh, to pick up two <coughs> magic bags. Yep. We got those for three ninety nine each. Yep. Um, we can collect them from ten. 10 till 10.30. 10 till 10.30. So it's 9 o'clock. It's going to take roughly about 30 minutes there. We like to get there early because like at the Chinese buffet, it was a first come, first serve. Yeah. We don't know how they all work. So we're just going to... Yeah, we'd rather not risk being last ones there, having a choice of not very good. But Yeah, and we don't know the area, so we need to work out where to park and everything. So yeah, we're going, so to, we're going to head off right now and get to the Northern Quarter of Ben Brazil. We'll see you in a second. Which for us is going to be about two hours. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers. Okay, see you soon. Bye. Hello everyone. We've just got back from Ben Brazil and the northern quarter of Manchester. Yeah. Um, it's took us about an hour and a half, hasn't it? Uh, we set off just all. after nine. It's just before half time. Yeah. Um, yeah, we um, uh, I took some photos. Of, uh, well, I took a photo of the outside um, of the, the restaurant. It was on the corner of the road. Um, but just before you get to it, if you come in at it, and it's going to be on the right hand side just before you get to it there's a side street i can't remember the name but i took a photo of the name of the street and i took a photo off the street so we can show you where we parked because it's um free to park there after 8 p.m yeah so um we, we had no trouble there yes yeah. just we were i think we were the first there walk. as well yeah it seemed to be we we, we, we got there a bit it was about uh, 10 to 10 to 10 yeah, we got there a bit early and they still served us straight yeah, away. Yeah, they'd already done it. The place so, was empty. Uh, it was yeah. supposed to be from 10 till half 10. Like I said, we got there about 10 to 5 to, something mm -hmm. like that. Uh, yeah. You went to the toilet. I went to the toilet and come and out. And it came out and I, I, I had the bag, so. Yeah. Right. Yeah, get into it. So we're hungry. So we've got three of these in each bag. They feel quite weighty, to be fair. That one's that one's cold, so I'm yeah, I'm, I'm interested I'm gonna... to see what's in that. I don't know if it's gone cold or if it's just stirred something, something like salad cold. Salad or some cheeses or. Oh yeah, yeah. This one's cold as well. Well, uh, so we'll open these first. Oh, so this one's got uh, pasta and a bit of uh, peppers and potato salad. Yep, I've got oh, the same. Got the same there. So that's it. That's cool. Yep. It's cool. We got all three of these for three ninety nine each. There. Yeah, three ninety nine each. Uh, this one's got rice and mushrooms and what looks like sweet, sweet potato, potato, mashed sweet potato or something. It smells good. Oh, oh, oh! I've got meat, lad. It's meat. So I've got a collection of. I've got some meat there. Various meat. Yep. That's what we went for. So that, that's not bad. We got we got three. That's a lot of food, three, really. Three decent little trays there. These are like normal takeaway trays, aren't they? Yeah. Like they are full. Yeah, I mean, this, this is all good. We've got spoons, we weren't sure what we were going to get, but I'm just going to just empty this all out onto the plate. Yeah. I'm going to empty everything that I want out. I'll let you try that sweet, what well, that looks like sweet potato first. Okay. That looks like a it's potato salad, that, isn't it? Yeah. And this looks like pesto pasta. Pesto pasta. These mushrooms smell good. Mushrooms smell very good. Pasta's a bit dry, but it's nice. It's probably been sat there all day. It's what's left over, so. Yeah. Try a couple of these spuds. I might get to half, I might get happy five a day with the bits of little bits of salad on here. Yeah, that's that's sweet potato mash. That's okay. Nice. Is it nice? Yeah. 
Mm. These fried mushrooms are really good. What what we're doing, we're trying to taste a bit of everything as quickly as possible. Um, for, for the sake of the review of the video, we don't need to eat the whole thing on camera. No. Mmm. That rice is good. The rice is very savoury. Mmm. It's like almost like um like a Mexican rice. Mmm. Or it might be Brazilian in this case. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> The pasta is good. I quite like it. It's not very dry for me, but... Okay. Might have just been a bit on the top or something. Sir, pepper, pepper salad. Mmm. Pepper salad? Is that a pepper, then? Th these are bits of chocolate. Oh, that one. Yeah. Mm. So... Yeah, it's like a pot potato salad with... That's got like a vinaigrette dressing on. Um, so that's quite sour. It's got bits of chopped up white onion. And bits of pepper. I mean, this is what everything you... Everything we've got looks like on the plate yeah. with um, none of the meat. Uh, sh should we do some sort of thumbnail for this? Um, like hold up the meat and that or something like that. Say, not too good to go. Yeah. yeah. Well, obviously we can't say that this is what, what you'll get if you go there. Yeah, because it's, it's just whatever they've got left. Okay, so this... That's chicken. That's uh, two chicken wings by the look of it. Um, some beef, it looks like roast beef. Yeah, that's. I've got a big bit of garlic beef. Ooh, that looks good. Mm. I've not got any of that. I've got. This looks like a lamb chop. Or a, a lamb, a cut of lamb mm. of some sort. Looks like I've got some like top side or something. Have you got any? Have you got more than one piece of that garlic beef? No, but I can I can cut it up and share it if you want. What's what's that you've got there? I don't know. That looks... do, you want, do you want to swap a chicken wing for something? Yeah, go on. Do you want that? Um, is that the same as this? I think that's the same as that, isn't okay. it? Okay. We we got we got lots of meat. Yeah. Some of the meat looks a bit dry. Um, but again, it's three ninety nine and it's leftover food. We're presumably. I think it costs normally like £25 for a meal in there. It's 20, I think, yeah, 25, 26 quid a head if you just want like a fresh sit down meal there. Mm. This was four quid. Mm. And we've not got a bad portion of meat, to be fair. There's no. more meat in that tray than you usually get in, you know, from like a takeaway. Yeah. If you was to order it fresh. So I'd rather take away like a tray with that full of meat and then everything else for four quid. Mm. It's good value, that. Mmm. I'm gonna try a chicken wing. Let me try some of that garlic beef as well when we get to it. Yeah. Chicken wing looks looks nice. Mmm. Oh, that's really nice. The chicken wing is nice. Yeah. Oh. That. Everything is really good. There's small niggles with each thing. We can't give this a rating because no. it's going to vary so much each time you go. But For four quid, I could not complain. Not at all. And I don't like, you know, I don't eat the salad and I've still got enough rice. I've still got enough pasta and I've got a massive tray of meat. Mm. So for four pound... I mean, it is quite late at night, so I don't know how much you'd always want to get this. Yeah, it's not, it's not always going to be convenient to eat your uh, dinner at half ten, eleven o'clock. But if and when it is, I couldn't recommend it highly mm. enough. This is, this is great stuff. So it'd be nice if the one in Liverpool did this as well. Do you know what? Like, like you say, the meat might be a bit cold, or but a lot of it is still moist. Mm. And, you know... Sometimes, you know, people will argue all day long and how, and how if a shit steak or like, yeah, steak should be hot or warm. If it's just warm and juicy, some people argue that's best. Some people will want it a bit hotter. Some people like, still like it cold in the middle. Mm. So, you know, it is open to interpretation and depends on where you're traveling from. Like we, we, for me, for us, it was 21 miles. So it took us about half an hour there, half an hour back. Mm -hmm. So it's cooled over that time. 
Yeah, it would have been warmer when we got it, but I don't yeah. think the temperature's an issue, to be honest. No, if we were really that bothered in the future, maybe we'd just take a fork and we could eat it as soon as we got it in the car. Mm. And then drive home, you know, there's... there's and that's an option, yeah. Mm, that's option, an option, so, there's you know... A lot more food than I was expecting here. Yeah, yeah that's, that's it, because we, we were... We, that's why we were looking forward to doing this, because it is expensive. It is seen as more, like, a more expensive restaurant than say the buffet club that was eight pound or give or take a quid or two mm. and this is 26 pound if you're to go at normal restaurant times mm -hmm. and what was buffet club 350 three pound three pound on too good to go yeah on too good to go yeah three pound on two, this is four pound yeah i'd happily go here most nights you know especially if you're working late or if you're students or uh, it's just yeah give it a go um Sometimes I'm, I can't say you'll have this this good of selection every night. And no, we don't know. We'll... When we ordered this, I actually said to Sean, "There was five left." And I think the only they usually only typically have five, and I said, "Let's order two each," mm. because you just don't know. We could have just got one of those yeah. meat rice pasta or meat rice salad, and I said. Let's order two. Show was like, nah, we'll just we'll we'll see what it's like. We'll just get one each for the yeah. validity of the review. Yeah, it's meant it's meant to be enough to serve a person. I think this is plenty for a, yeah. a good meal for one. You could probably share this between two people. Like if if you've if you've had a white dinner earlier in the evening, six seven o'clock, and get this later on. Ooh. You know, it's two pound each plus getting there. Obviously, um, it's it's great stuff. That looks like a good bit. Yeah, oh, nice one. Cheers. I think. I think there's not much more to say. No, I think we can. I think you there. really have to check it out, <clears throat> and again, just check out more on Too Good to Go. Yeah, uh, they're adding more places all the time, and yeah, and um, yeah, <laughs> let's eat steak. Yeah, nice one. Thanks very much for joining us, guys. We'll see you next time. Cheers.